Hello friends. Welcome back to Unite Coaching. This is the new series of videos from Unite Coaching, in which we are guiding you about different types of government exams related to civil engineering branch, how to prepare for that, what strategies should be followed and so on. So let's start with the video. In this second video, we will be discuss some of the multiple choice questions on regional planning and development which will be helpful for assistant town planner post. So let's take a look at it. The first question is, the rough equivalent of the present tenement cities that existed in ancient Rome, which resulted from the population growth of the city and the congestion that existed in streets is. So the correct answer is, insula. The second question is, which code mandates that all local government units shall prepare their comprehensive land use plans and enact them through zoning ordinances? Correct answer is, Local Government Code, 1991 RA 7160. Now, the third question. A land development decision is also what kind of dash dash decision? And the correct answer is, traffic. The fourth question is, a wide area of parks of undeveloped land surrounding a community is called. The correct answer is, green belt. The fifth question is, which among the following is not a cause of growth of cities? The answer is simple, hygienic outlook of people. Now the sixth question, who developed the concept of urbanism as a way of life? Answer is A, Louis Vieth. Now the next question. Who has given the concept of urban fringe? Answer is Amens Rinivers. Now the next question, the orderly arrangement of urban streets and public spaces is called? Answer is A, city planning. Now the ninth question, usually the last stage of the final site development process prior to issuance of building permit is known as? Answer is, final plat. Next question, who conceptualized the city beautiful movement? Answer is, Daniel Burnham. Next question, a type of planning which emphasizes that the proper role of the planner is not to serve the general public interest but rather to serve the interests of the least fortunate or least well represented groups in society. Answer is, advocacy planning. Now, twelfth question. The process in which a piece of land, referred to as the parent tract, is subdivided into two or more parcels is. Answer is, platting. Next thirteenth question, how many types of land use patterns are there? Answer is, ten. Next question, general land use planning deals with. The answer is, forests. Now, fifteenth question. The land supply for urban expansion can be determined by formula. Answer is, option A, that is, total land area of a city, minus, protected conservation areas, plus, built up areas. Last, 16th questions, noise map which are the maps which help to quantify the noise of a region and evaluate the population exposed to it, help to create a database for planning of zones is an excellent tool for urban planning. It is true, so the options is A. So friends, thanks for watching this video. Hope you liked this video. If you want more videos of this category, please comment below. Please like, share and subscribe to Unite Coaching for more such videos.